Are you in need of FIFA 22 coins to improve your squad? Look no further than u7buy.com, offering some of the cheapest coins on the market, whilst being one of the safest and the most reliable websites around in the market today. Make sure as well, if you do go to the website, you use code VIPER at checkout to get yourself a discount. Let's get into the video. What's going on guys, Viper here, and welcome to the second video of the day. In this one, we're going to be reviewing headliners Dimitri Payet. Now, this is quite an expensive SPC, which I was a bit shocked at when I saw it. It's an 86-rated squad with an inform. Is that right? Yeah. An 85-rated squad with an inform. Um, high chemistry requirements as well, which is insane to me, because at the end of the day, this is not the best card in the world. Um, obviously, they've got the opportunity of the headliner streak. Marseille are not a bad side. and They do blow hot and cold a little bit, um, but there's an opportunity at the headliner streak there if they win four games in a row. If Payet gets any informs as well, which I wouldn't be surprised if he does, he always seems to pop up with informs. This card can also get upgraded there as well. Um, but yeah, it's an expensive SPC. I, I think it's coming in at like 100, 150k. Quite expensive for this card. And they have juiced him up quite a lot, as you'd expect. Um, as we look at his stats though, or his uh, base card stats, first of all, 5 foot 9, high medium, right footed, 4 star, 4 star. He's got 85 pace, 88 dribbling, 84 shooting, 89 passing, and uh, 74 physical. Shame his defending isn't very good. Um, if they'd done his defending up, defending up, that would have been really, really nice to be able to use him as a central midfielder. Um, in terms of his traits, he's got flair and outside of the foot shot. Very, very disappointing that he doesn't have finesse shot, but his curve should be quite good. Um, I'm anticipating... So, let's look at his in-game stats. So, he's got a good pace split at 87-84. Um, 86 attack positioning, 83 finishing, 87 shot power, 84 long shots, 83 volleys and 86 penalties. He's got really good vision at 90, really good crossing at 91. Poor free kick accuracy um, for Dim Dimitri Payet. Um, his gold common card has got like 74 free kick accuracy. Insane. Um, 90 short pass. And 86 long pass with an 89 curve, which is nice. Now, here are where the issues start coming in. I can't believe EA prices at, the, at this price, to be honest. 87 agility, 82 balance, 80 reactions, 90 ball control and 90 dribbling, which is really nice. 80 composure, and he's got 78 stamina and 80 strength. Obviously, this is a position change as well. He's a left wing by default. They've made him central now, which I think a lot of people are going to be happy about. But this SPC is extremely, extremely overpriced. Um, I'm very surprised at the price they put it at. Um, but yeah, that, that's how the cookie crumbles with EA. Uh, it doesn't make much sense at all. There must be something broken about this card in game to for them to price it at that level. Um, but the low stamina is a bit of an issue. He's got good strength, which is nice. Um, his dribbling stats generally are quite poor. I think that's what we're going to work on is his dribbling stats. Um, and you know what I'm like, guys? I do love myself a cheeky little engine. I think that's the chemistry style that suits Dimitri Payet the best. Um, get the pace upgrade, taking it up to 90 pace on his base card stat. He's going up to 92 acceleration and 89 sprint speed. Plus 5 on the vision, taking it up to 95. Maxed out crossing at 99. He's got great short pass now at 95 and great long pass at um, 91. Max out curve, which is really, really nice to have. Um, he's got 92 agility and 92 balance, which is also a really nice upgrade. And then plus 9 on the dribbling, maxing that out to 99 as well. So that's the upgrade you'll get him with the card, guys. Um, not the best in the world um, in terms of a player, in my opinion. We're going to be playing him in champs in the 4 one 2 2 narrow as our, uh, as our cam there. I think that's his best position as well. He's not really good enough to play striker. He's not good enough to play left mid, right mid. He's definitely another central cam. He yeah, seemed to be bombarding us with uh, middle cams on this game at the moment. But guys... With that being said, let's get into a game of Payet and see how we get on with him. Right then, guys, into champs we go with Demi Payet. I don't know what to expect, man, because I've got a feeling, just because of how he used to play in real life for West Ham, I've got a feeling his finesse shots are going to be really, really good. What I'm probably going to do, guys, I'm only going to probably play one game as well today. Uh, I'm a bit busy this evening. If this guy wants to ready up, that is, that would be absolutely wonderful. Okay, I'm just going to keep you with me. We're going to play a full game together. Um, but yeah, that guy just didn't fancy ready enough, I suppose. Fair play to him. Um, I am somewhat excited to use him though, strangely enough. I'm not exactly sure. That's a good team. Bloody hell. 
That's a very good team. Yeah, I'm a bit busy this evening, so I can only play one. That is a that is a really, really good team to come up against. I don't like Upi Mencano. I think he's quite poor. Um, yeah, that's a really good team outside of that. Hope you guys are enjoying the content and you're enjoying Headliners. If you are, then fair play, because I'm not. All right, boys, this guy did just go 1-0 up. I just got... Uh, I had to cut the video there for a second. Uh, but we're back now. It was a good goal from him. Um... Yeah, one nil down already, which is uh, quite poor from me, but I'm sure we'll be fine. Um, here we go. Here he is. I really want to try out his finesses, man. He doesn't. He doesn't feel bad on the ball. Oh, nice. Oh, that's such a bad pass. Buy it there. Really, really poor. This guy's just a. Uh, you know, d d doing what everybody else does and just hitting on the break. You've got to respect it at some point, haven't you? Even though it's, it's, it's turned it into the most boring, boring F FIFA game ever. Are you playing Alarm at CDM? Yeah, his dribbling's quite nice, actually. Credit where it's due. Right? We would expect it for a card that's costing that much, right? This guy's jarring to play against, so... The way he plays. I was getting stressed out about this on stream earlier, so I, I don't want to... I, I, I don't know, man. What the hell? I mean, maybe I'm forcing it a bit too much through him, but... This guy is just such a jarring player, man. Everybody plays the same, though, right? So everybody just hitting on the break and stuff. The players aren't making very good runs or, or anything of the sort, really, though. Oh, dear. This might be a steer clear, guys, honestly. This really might be a steer clear. I've not enjoyed him one bit so far. Nah, he's not good. I, I, you guys wouldn't have needed my, uh, my opinion to see that this card's not very good. It's a good finish, to be fair. It is Neymar, though. <laughs> um, yeah, you, you, you don't need to see me to... You don't need to, to, to look at me to see that this is a bad, bad card. Um, I, I really don't understand the pricing of it, which is which is why I'm so uh, so interested to review him because I, I feel like when EA like price cards out like this, oh he's offside trapping too, man. What a sweaty first game, eh? I uh, he 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 just doesn't have what I was expecting. Um, I thought he was going to be quite sharp on the ball. He does have a good sprint boost, and his dribbling feels okay, but he doesn't feel nearly as sharp as I was anticipating him to feel. Um, which is a bit, bit bit of a disappointment so far. Um, he's got really low aggression as well, which is annoying. Nice check. <clears throat> Still early doors, though. I, I don't want to give my verdict just yet. You know, he, he, he might change my opinion. But so far, I really, really don't see it. This guy is annoying, man. He's good. This guy's a good player. Holy smokes, is he annoying to play against. Whatever game. <clears throat> let's, uh, let, let's see what we can do. We, we're stressing out too much. This game just is in a bad spot right now. Well, then, Payette, what a run that is. We've got Kyle Walker stepping up like that. That's crazy. Isn't he his right back? Oh, man. Oh, man, I'm getting stressed. I've got to stop. Calm down, calm down. He, look, look, he just doesn't really dribble how you'd expect to play of that caliber. To Oh, my God. Nice, good finish, best. Good pass there. He's going to rage quit, and we're just going to get in straight into another one. I'll be very... Su wow, that's surprising, man. He was giving me a good game. Fair enough. We'll get into one more, then. Um, I'll, I'll keep you guys with me as well. Um, and yeah, we'll just get into the second game. He doesn't. He he didn't feel great though. There, I'll be honest. He didn't feel very special. He didn't feel like he had any unique qualities. Uh, so, not not a good look for the first one. I'm afraid. Um, but here's the second the second guy. I've recognised this this guy's gamer tag. I, I've definitely played him before. I think he's a sweat. He's got that Martial as well, which is a goated card. 
This could be another sweaty one. A good test for Payet. If he's not good in this one, guys, then I would say steer clear. Simple as. That's a foul ref. Thank you. Right, let's take our time. Into him. Easy pass. George Best has overran it, though. Oh, dear. Maybe I should have played it earlier. Maybe that's my own doing. Oh, that's unlucky. He, he does have good um, good pass. I will, I will give him that. I really want to try a few finesses with him, though, man. You know? I, I'm, I'm just, like, kind of, like, trying to play him like the West Ham Pyatt. I know they kind of ruined his card since then because he hasn't been very good. Or not as good. Nice new card, eh? Good card, that one. His dribbling feels a bit sus, actually. There you go. There's the first chance I've read of it. Poor. I, I, I assume if we do get in the, in the right position, his uh, finesses are going to be broken. Just because it's Dimmy Pyatt, right? His passing is very clean. Yeah, that's a nice finish. That's a really nice finish, that. He has got good, good, good passing. His dribbling is is good, but it's not the best. Um, his shooting seems very, very strong as well. Oh, come on, man. I know it's my own doing, but this this game is just stressing me out. <clears throat> I'm so surprised that last guy left. And this guy is actually a decent player if it's the guy who I remember playing before. What's your long passes like, pal? It's unlucky. Couldn't get uh, in front of Kimpembe there. Where are you, buddy? Right, let's try Finesse with you. This is where I'm really expecting you to shine. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Line it up. Oh, off the post. Off the post. Okay, he's got good finesses, which is what we were uh, anticipating, really. His dribbling does leave a little bit to be desired, though. He's got he's got actually quite good strength, hasn't he? Which is uh, quite nice for a cam. You don't often get good strength on cams. Oh, wow. This is something, something that doesn't feel right with the card, guys. I can't tell you exactly what it is because I, I'm, I'm not actually sure. Um, hopefully by the end of this game I'll be able to tell you. Go on, Demi. Yeah, see that? His, his dribbling just feels a bit, like, clunky. For lack of a better word. His finesse shots are good. I mean, I, I've yellowed that. Um, his finesse shots are good, though, for sure. Wow, why didn't they play on there? Oh, he's offside. Thank you. Let's just see what if, if you know. Look at him! Look, what's he doing? Well then, Demi. Pen. That's a hundred percent a penalty. Wow. Yeah, his, his shot cancels are quite uh, slow. That was a shot cancel there. And, and, and I'm uh, like, I don't think, oh my days, game. I don't think any time I've done a shot, oh my God. Any time I've done a shot cancel against a goalkeeper, I've, I'm, I've never not rounded them. Um, so it's, it's a bit odd to see that. He does make good runs there though, look. He's in. He's actually in. Wow. That's that's meant to do that, I swear to God. Well then, Dimmy, this is your position, pal. Oh, yes. Oh. His finesse shots aren't as good as uh, Ben Rama's. I mean, I know it's on his weak foot, right? He's got a four-star weak foot. He's good, He's good though. His finishing's bad. Is he there again? Yes, yes. Come on, then. Oh, man. This is not my kind of card, I must admit. 
I can't believe they've priced it out at this as well though guys. I really can't believe the, the pricing of this card. If you're a West Ham fan, you'll probably do him. If you're a Marseille fan, you'll probably do him. This is a this, this has been disappointing so far though. Good defending the Akate. He's so good. Uh yeah, I'm, 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 I must admit I'm not I'm not impressed. I'm 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 really not. Um, I would argue that this that this promo generally for player SPCs and and all that kind of jazz, apart from the objectives, which have been awesome to be fair, pr pretty damn bad promo in my opinion. There's Demi. Thank you for opening up for me, buddy. That's two nil, and he he he's a very very strange card, right? I think because he's got good strength and his body type is a bit a bit different from what you'd expect from a cam. Oh my god, uh, he, he kind of doesn't have the the technical ability that I was expecting. Um, I, I was oh my god, that was a manual tackle, by the way. Yeah, see, his shot cancels now. I want to be a lot cleaner um, with his, with his dribbling capabilities. He does feel quite strong though, which it, which is a nice nice factor of the card. And that's half time, guys. That's half time. I think this guy might leave as well, to be honest. He's been uh, a strange card so far. I think you'll be hard pressed to find value out of this, though. You, you know, at, at the value he's coming in at, it's, it's, it's very, very hard to say that he's uh, he's worth the value. You know, um, still plenty of time, though. You know, like it's 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 so hard to review these cards. When they just don't, they don't have the, the 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 kind of qualities that you need. He's a bit too slow. His passing is good though. I, I will give him some credit there. His passing is really good. We see he's still got another half to change my mind though. You never know. He he might uh he might change our mind in this uh this second half here, but I do doubt it. So what it's all about though, guys. Reviewing the players. He's left. He's left. I feel like I have to do another game now. I don't really have time, though. Let me see what we do, guys. All right, guys. So I don't really have time to play another game. Um, this card is very, very strange. Uh, two goals, two assists in two games, which is nice. His passing is awesome. I can't lie. I do really enjoy his passing. His dribbling is good, but then the reactions and composure will let you down in the dribbling category and when you're shooting with him. The composure, if he's getting hard-pressed... They will just uh, fly over and, and, and not be good shots. His stamina is poor. Um, if you're going to be playing him at middle cam, the player needs a lot of stamina. Um, 80 strength is nice, and that's a nice, unique thing to have on a cam. Not many cams have good strength, um, which is a really nice thing to have, I, I won't lie. Um, adds a different dimension into your play, especially when he's got that good passing. He can hold people off and then thread a good through ball. That is nice. I, I will give him that. That's a really nice, unique quality that not many cards have in this game. Um, shooting wasn't the best either. Finesse shots were kind of underwhelming for what I was expecting. Um, but the, the, the main thing that we're talking about here is his passing. And if that is what we're going to talk about, complete him. His passing is brilliant. Um, dribbling. And if I'm going to rate them all out of 10, like his individual uh, base card stats... I'd give his pace like a 7 out of 10. And that didn't feel the worst. Uh, but, but because of his uh, body type, he does feel a little bit slow in some areas. Shooting, I'm going to give a 4 out of 10. Um, his power shots are really nice in the box. But when he has such low composure, it is kind of hard to make good shots with him. Um, so yeah, 4 out of 10 there. Passing, I'm going to give a 9 out of 10. I really, really liked his passing. Um... The curve at 99 and the finesse shots didn't feel good, which was strange for me, uh, especially when Ben Rama's finesse shots were so good. Um, but yeah, his passing is his best attribute um, by a mile. His uh, dribbling... Uh, this is the hardest one to rate, though, the dribbling one. I'm probably going to give that a... 6 out of 10. Because uh, his dribbling stats are really nice. Um... And he does have them instances where when he turns really quickly, 
and he feels like a really agile dribbler, but he doesn't offer that consistently, which is an issue as well, in my opinion. Um, even with the engine, he doesn't really offer it consistently enough. And the low reactions and composure are quite jarring to deal with at times, as I've already suggested with the composure. Um, and low reactions just isn't good, especially on somebody that's supposed to be a technical player. Um, good, good intricate passing and good dribbling. Low reactions is an absolute no-go. And the strength of the physicals, you've kind of got to go down the middle because it's really nice to have that strength. Um, 5 out of 10 for me. But then the stamina is an issue. I would say, overall, um, this card is a 6 out of 10. He is a bit above average. Um, but I would not complete the SPC, personally. Don't think it's worth it. Avoid him. Wait for some other stuff to come out. We've got Team of the Year around the corner. Don't bother sinking your coins into this. But guys, if you did enjoy today's video, make sure you leave a like on it and you subscribe to the channel so you never miss an upload. Also turn on the bell so you never miss a player review. Um, but guys, yeah, that's going to be it from me for now. So take care.